ancient Egyptians believed in the power of amulets and other charms to protect themselves from evil forces and to bring them good fortune. And among many, the scarab amulets were the most popular. The sun, the Ra, sun Ra, rolls, rolls across the sky, sky each day, day and day transforms body, bodies by body, soul. soul. The dung, the dung beetle's rolling of dung into a ball for the purposes of laying eggs, which would be later transformed into larva, was seen as an earthly symbol of this heavenly cycle. This came to be iconographic and what is it? An ideological? What is it? Ideological? Ideological? There's an and. Ideological. 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 Iconographic. In ancient Egypt, the scarabs were usually made of green stone. Green is the color of the heart. Heart scarabs, or mummified beetles, were placed next to the heart after the body was mummified. The heart was the place of the soul and the scarab protected the deceased person's soul from being eaten by Amit the Devourer, a dreadful part lion, part hippo, part crocodile who guarded scales of justice in the Egyptian afterworld. to make a 16 bug power motor. And um, so he made this contraption out of um, straw. It was little, like kind of like windmill. He wanted to glue 16 bugs to it. And then when the bugs would like start to freak out, they would fly, and the whole thing would fly. When he was 17 or something like this, where he took to his bed, and his father said, okay, now, you, okay, that's it. You don't have to be a priest. I, 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 I let you, I release you from that. It's okay, you can be an engineer. Walk in the mountains for a year, get your health back. And he said once he set his foot on that path, he was never uh, weak again in his life, and I know that's Will. Progressive development of man is vitally dependent on invention. It is the most important product of his creative brain. Its ultimate purpose is the complete mastery of mind over the material world, the harnessing of the forces of nature to human needs. <laughs>